<laughs> Welcome to Good Mythical More. We're gonna taste some vegan egg scrambles and also figure out why Rhett won't eat his wife's eggs. Mm, okay, we're gonna talk about that. I, I was hoping you would forget. But I first, we're forget. gonna do a new selfie face. And today's new selfie is called Tickle Party. <laughs> <laughs> I gave you some motion for that one. I think you may have blurred it. Um, okay. So, all right, br bring, up, bring over the, oh, my, my chair just went down. You see that? Oh, oh gosh. Bring over Took the something out. So we've got, we've got a number of vegan eggs that have been scrambled. Um, wow, that does not look tasty. It doesn't look like, I mean, from a distance it looks like eggs. So we're gonna, we're gonna taste all like these. something you get at camp. And we're gonna guess what they are. So I'll go ahead and tell you the, um, the brands that we're, that we're working with here. Just, that's one of them. Vegan Egg. Simple. That's Elliot. another one. Bob's Red Mill. Bob's your uncle. Veg Power Scramble. And last but not least, Rhett do the honors. Orgran Vegan Easy Egg. Is that a, not a misprint? Orgran? That's the no. worst name I've ever heard. Hold on. Is Wait, you, Oregon. Yeah, well it's not Oregon if they took if they took that R out. The second one? Uh, it's just, it makes It'd be even worse. Organs. organs. Organ vegan, easy egg. You know, it's made from other organs, but not the but egg. vegan. We have nothing to go on. Um, this is stupid. <laughs> no, it's not. I but, mean, but, but you know what? Well, we're, we're gonna rank. We'll tell you how good they are. We're gonna rank them. And so even though we don't know what it is, it's we should know what it is, because that's part of the blind test. Now I'm uh, getting. Did you salt and pepper these? Don't believe you did. Yeah, it just looks like. Good Lord. Nothing about this tastes anything like eggs. It's it, just yellow. It has the almost consistency of a scrambled egg. But it tastes like plant matter. Yeah, it's like it's mush. Like, that's what it is. It's just mush. Um, so, so, I mean. I'm gonna put that at the bottom of the list. Let's just assume that so it can't get any worse. Let's say this is the top. This yeah, is the yeah, best. Yeah, yeah. Let's assume it can't get any worse. And uh, you know what? I'm gonna say that's just. <laughs> I mean, because it's just. It's just here. It's just here. I have yeah. no clue. All right. Oh, look. This one's this one's browner. Looks what? even worse. That looks like old pudding. Now, but see, this is helping set up what I want to talk about, which is now I was thinking about eggs in, in preparation for this episode. I just like to sit back and think about things a little bit, and I was like, you know what? Chickens. What is the deal with chicken eggs? What is the deal with them? Like. They lay what, are them every you, day. You, you lay them every day, and if they're not fer fertilized. You can eat them. You can eat them. You can eat them if they are fertilized, but it's cooler to eat them if they're not fertilized. Yeah, and so over time, chickens have been modified by man, genetically modified by men through like, and women, through breeding. Yeah. Um, to make them lay a bunch of eggs all year round. And if the are you saying before they were modified, there was an egg season? Yeah, there was an egg season, like like other birds, they only lay eggs at certain times, and they give the signals for the for the male bird to come around and make it something, make it something permanent, like another bird being. What is this like? So it got me thinking. That is much worse than the first one. I mean, I didn't think it could get worse. Ah, oh, slimy. That Con is awful. Congeal. It's it's gelatinous. It is absolutely awful. Oh, suddenly it makes these seem awesome. I mean, they put the yellow food coloring in there and everything. Yeah, this is now. Yeah, this is now good. So it got me thinking. If my wife, I'll just say your wife. Why do they keep getting browner? Look at that. That is some. It's, I mean, what? It, this is like someone who who failed at making a pancake. Yeah, I've like seen it, that many times. It's like a fa pancake remnant. So if your wife could lay eggs. Well, she can technically. Like a but chicken she egg. lay them. Like it was in a shell and it popped out every morning or every evening. What the hell? Would you eat it? It would be better than this. It's, it did, would, let's did say. You, did it, you purposely make them get worse as you went? Was that part of it? Yeah, I know, we thought that was bad. If, well, okay. oh my God, it's like dough. If she, okay. It's so spongy. Let me ask you a question before I answer this question. It tastes like a chicken egg, okay? Did you drink your wife's milk? Did you try it one time? Well, that, that's not an appropriate question. This is three times as bad as the last one. 
What? How could someone think that this is a good idea? This is a different thing. This That's, is not even trying to be, this is like dough. I can't swallow this one. I cannot swallow this one. That's a first. It's horrible. It tastes a little bit like egg. Did you, did you, don't dodge the question, did you drink your wife's milk? No. Did you? No, I thought about it. Yeah, because it, it wasn't intended for me. But if as a society we agreed, hey, you know what? If a lot of a lot if, of if, a lot of guys if do if humans though. can lay eggs. Hold on, a lot of guys do try it. Okay, that's fine. No judgment. That's not what I'm talking about. But if it's an egg, that's different because it's more like chicken. I mean, I guess it's not that different. No, because you. What, what about a cow? You drink the cow's milk. Yeah. And you didn't drink your wife's milk. Why yeah. are you gonna eat your wife's eggs? Well, because the the because it tastes nasty. You don't know that though. I mean, we you, tasted another woman's breast milk on the show. But we didn't taste and it tasted our wives' nasty. Egg, our wives' milk. Maybe they got good milk. Uh, probably not. Oh, this one's got a green hue to it. <laughs> I mean, it it kind of looks like the hair on my shirt. I think if I were to eat a woman's egg, it I think I would rather it come from a strange stranger, like a woman who specializes in selling her own eggs for, you, for the consumption. You talking about like women in farms? That doesn't sound right. <laughs> no, like a woman who's like self-employed. Like, what do you do? Like I, Kate, I sell my as, eggs. You're saying as long as they're cage-free women them, eggs. A roadside egg stand. Well, she's actually a roadside egg sit. <laughs> she's, she's she's not. Got, she's got to lay them for you. Well, she she she, but she doesn't have to. How uh, big would they be? I think they'd be bigger than a chicken because a person's bigger. But than But smaller a chicken. than an ostrich. Yeah, they'd be. I'd uh, be a full a full meal. Golly, this smells like dog food. <laughs> this is unreal. I like. I'm not bashing on like vegan products because I actually enjoy oh. a lot of them. I like vegan ice cream. I think a few of these aren't supposed to be. Well, that's evident. <laughs> it literally tastes like dog food too. It's it's got that um proteinish protein shake consistency, but it that is, put that one on the end. I can't. No, no, it's not as bad as these. As bad as it is, go back and try to taste this. You think it's worse than this one? That one doesn't have as strong of a taste. I think that one's. I think that one may be the worst. I put that in between it. This one's like gooey bread. This is like, but it tastes horrible. So we're gonna do that. We're putting this bag at the top. We thought it was the bottom. It is a I little mean, different if, though if because it's, it's from a human. If it's culturally accepted to eat human unfertilized eggs. Then I think everybody would get on board. Here's why. Here's here's why I don't okay. think it is. It, but he, well, not only because you just a different kind of egg, but also you already eat the chicken too. Like you're already eating the thing that makes the egg. We don't eat other people. No. So why should we start drinking their milk and eating their eggs? But an unfertilized egg is just in a, in a chicken. It's mostly just the just the nutrient that if it were to be fertilized that the embryo would like eat. No, but it's also the DNA of the of the the mother. I mean, it's got, right? Doesn't it have everything? Doesn't that egg have what? Yeah, it, it has to have. So basically you're eating like half of a chicken. Like this could have been a chicken, but it didn't, it, but it's not. It's not a chicken because the rooster didn't come around. Exactly. So, come so, around see, being the. See what I'm saying? You're starting to think mm. of chicken eggs as nasty, but you eat them and you enjoy them. So just get in that headspace and also, eat your wife's unfertilized eggs. But I also eat the chicken. I haven't thought about that as nasty. Now yet. look at this. This one. This one's got some promise. This one smells different. Uh, it, 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 this it, one's it, better. This one's better. But it's it's tough. It's to still eat. horrible. It has a consistency at first of eggs. And then it, it's the best one. It turns into plant mush. It tastes like eating plant but mush. What I could do with this one is I could put cheese on it. I mean, this is like a continental breakfast. I could put cheese on like this a one cheap hotel and put some salt and pepper, and it could be good. All right, this is the last one. This one's better than that one. Okay. Ooh. All right. Fluffy, fluffy. The current run of Bleak Creek merch. I'm doing a little announcement now. 
is going away forever. So it is your last chance to grab that piece of merch that you've been eyeing. Um, so go over to mythical.com and pick it up. Now one of these is not vegan. And it's this one. But this is not good. It would be fine if it, that's like egg beaters or something like that, I had that. Took it on a camping trip one time. Yeah, it's definitely the best. Um, I, I think some salt and pepper on it, it's not bad. I think this one is better than that one. The first one we ate, I feel like, well first of all, is what we just ate egg beaters, it's actual eggs? Okay, yeah, so we're right about that. It's just painfully obvious that none of this stuff can can beat egg beaters. So, egg beaters, uh, what, what's, our, what's our last place? Well, let's, let's, let's guess. Let's look at it, I can tell you. Let's just look at the packaging and we can figure it out. Orgran. Orgran is the one that we like, I believe. Just going by the color on the box. Oh, that one? Um, Bob's Red Mill Egg Replacer, equivalent to 34 eggs. Now, Bob, uh, we've got some Bob's Red Mill pancake uh, stuff at the house. I think that's what this is. And it's not is, bad. Because this is like pancakes. You don't, you, you think he didn't think, change the color? You think Bob, he cares that little about making it look like Maybe he does. Yeah, because this veg stuff, power scramble. Now that isn't that a isn't that a cute little design? We're talking like Animal Crossing situation. I think that the just over there, which is a cool package, I think that is this right here because it just it looks so like futuristic. It, it looks that yeah, it does look futuristic, doesn't it? Um, I don't know. I feel like oh, but look at this. So we don't know where to put that yet. Vegan egg. Oh, they want you to, they, oh, they, they're trying to that. fool you you're into thinking up, that and you're it's opening up real eggs. See, this is the same situation as this. And I think it's this one right here. Okay. I think this is Which it. Which means we're putting that. All right, these are our final answers. We feel good about this. Can we, can we get a confirmation that we are correct? The order that you ate them in is the exact same order that we <laughs> oh. gave to you in. <laughs> oh, oh so, so, we, so we were right. We no, were no, 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 no. So no, no. This, this is just. just. And then. The vegan egg, we ate second. I think, I don't know. <laughs> I think it was this one. I think then I this one. have the answers. If we're looking for answers. I think it's that this is a confusing one. way to do things, but. Your number two spot next to egg beaters is Orgran. Yeah, right. I think this is the order there. Your number three spot is Just. Right, uh huh. Your number four spot is Vegan Egg. Yep. Your number five spot is Veg Power Scramble. And your number six spot is Bob's Red Mill. Mm -mm. See, this is just for your baking needs. So. Uh, don't try to eat this stuff straight. This Orgran, horrible name, uh, you could take the egg, but none of it's gonna beat like a uh, human woman. <laughs> Let's just be honest. But the thing about this is, is that this is like if you're making a cake and you want it to be a vegan cake. Yeah, yeah. So, so, that, that, so that, I feel like we did Bob, we did Bob and. and just don't eat it straight, that's what I said. Justice. But this right here, that's pretty cool. And uh, by the way, I do not condone or promote eating the eggs of women or the milk of them either. I don't either, it's just, it's just hypothetical. Get our novel, The Lost Causes of Bleak Creek in the paperback edition by visiting bleakcreek.com.